Overcharger is surprisingly good. I'm honestly shocked that I never tried this overclock out sooner because I do love some heavy damage overclocks. What Overcharger does is grant the EPC more charge shot damage and area damage, and it also charges a lot faster too, but at the cost of a slower cooling rate, and it now takes an extra two ammo when shooting out charge shots. But this overclock deals heavy damage to all forms of the grunts, and when built properly, and aimed properly, you can dish out some nice damage to the big boys as well. You'll see. Also, make sure to subscribe for more content like this in the future. Alrighty. Let's try, let's try a different build out now. Oh, another Huli Hoarder. Oh, hell yeah. Oh my god. Alright, this already has a lot more promise. That was way faster killing it. Alright, alright. So, this build video is, is gonna be a little bit... To me, it's gonna be really, really lackluster and all over the place. To you guys, it's just gonna probably be one video. At least I hope it is. Oh my god, yes, we're starting with Nitro. Alright, so... I was trying this build out first with the sludge pump. I was trying overcharger out with the sludge pump because I remember someone recommending that in my stream to try overcharger out with burning nightmare. And I was like, you know what? I'll try that out in the build video and see just how good it is. And then I was like, why don't I just bring it with the goo bomber specialist on the sludge pump? It'll be, you know, spreading the goo around. I'll be able to ignite that on fire and do really good damage. Well, that mission I played, I could not find a single bit of nitro. There was like no loot bugs anywhere. And, uh, oh my God. Hell yeah, I got an air cube out of the Christmas presents. I have been a good dwarf. And it's just like, I could not find a single loot bug. The only loot bugs I could find were in those presents. And then on top of that, a nemesis spawned in. And that was kind of what made game over happen. I'm sorry, I am I'm gonna I am gonna kill every single loot bug I see because ah oh, that mission sucked. I think there was some in an off cave and oh my god. And I was able to find a vein just to get one resupply, but it didn't help because a Mactera plague happened and Nemesis was still alive. There he is. I have been a good dwarf. I got air cube out of presents. You know, that's a story. Um, me and my friend Darkbow, we actually found three air cubes one time on an elite deep dive. So we got 15,000 extra XP since each air cube is 5,000 XP. Oh, come on now. Where are you? You. Get back here. Oh, machine event. Wow. Only I am going to deposit that and do that. Alright, cool. Cool, alright. You know, that actually helps kill those off because it's always so unsatisfying using Ice Storm to kill those Praetorians off with this type of build. I'm using my range ammo build so I can freeze them at a range. I can't do as much damage as I usually do. So yeah, no, this kind of helps. Just do this, and then goodbye. Yeah, no, that's actually really good. Holy shit. This is a lot better with, with the cryo cannon. Damn, dude, all right. I, in all honesty, I should have just done thin containment field because I brought splash damage to see if it'll help a little bit with the grunts, just to do a little bit of AOE. But I mean, I just do so much damage to all the grunts with the cryo cannon. It's just like, I don't even need to. <laughs> Alrighty. Nice. Oh man, speaking of Christmas presents, I'm so excited. I am so excited for Christmas. I'm so excited for my dad to see what I got him. That's what I'm really excited for. As I've grown, I've learned that it's more fun to give gifts than to get gifts. As a child, it's like, ooh, free stuff. Ooh, now as an adult, it's just like, ah, oh, I'm so excited to see what, 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 what I got them. It's so much fun, honestly. I love gift giving. Also, my sister during my stream 
she she was trying to join it she called me back and was just like i could not find you i couldn't find your stream could you just tell me your channel i gave her a hint i just said fang and then i just that's where i ended it she has to find it for herself The amount of damage they do does not, like, compare. It's so bad. Vampire just does not help at all. For him. Okay, cool. Cool. Done. Hell yeah. Wish killing the spiders on here was just as easy on Lethal Company. Oh my god. So, I, play, I, I did play Lethal Company with my friends. And I will say, by far, I... The, mo the enemy I hate the most is the spider. Not because I have arachnophobia or anything. I just hate, like, how his movement is just a bunch of random thumping that you hear. Like, that is just the most unsettling thing to hear walking around in the facility. And I hate the fact that he just camps. I hate it. I he just camps a bunch of different corridors that you need to go down. He's just like, Oh yes, I shall sit here and wait for my unsuspected victims. Speaking of that. <laughs> I know people will probably argue, Oh, you could have brought Burning Nightmare and, and the Temp Shock would have killed him way faster. Man, 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 shut up. This is my video. I'll do what I want. <laughs> I so badly want to encounter one specific enemy though in Lethal Company. And that was the Nutcracker because he gives a shotgun. And you can kill things with it. And when I heard that, I was like, oh, hell yeah. I'll just kill all the enemies I see. <laughs> Stupid. I am a walking hazard. Did he really go all the way up here? Oh, he died. Well, bunker up, they say. If I time this correctly, I can infinitely shoot this thing. You know what? I'm gonna. You know what? <clears throat> Overcharger is actually pretty good. I'll say that right now. Overcharger is actually pretty good. Bro. Oh. No, oh, you check your oxygen. It was. Check the recording. Check the recording footage. I know you guys always record whatever the hell we do. Through some jad is. You know what? Pick that up, Bosco. Yeah, I better hurry before freaking Molly beats me to the drop pod. I said, Molly better still be on the course that she's on. Overcharge is actually pretty okay. It's pretty good, but I wouldn't say it's something I would take a lot. Probably because I still need to get kind of used to its build. I think the one thing I'll change about this is probably take thin containment fields so you can shoot this three times rather than two times. Other than that though, it's actually a pretty good build. Oh yeah. So it's pretty, pretty powerful. And we didn't get down to either. And we got an air cube finally. Hell yeah, man. Nice. <laughs> Loot bug. You're mine. Yep. Look at that. Hell yeah. <laughs>